Hey everybody, Scott here. In this video, we're gonna talk about how to take a screenshot of your computer screen. And it's really pretty easy to do. There's a whole bunch of ways to do it. And if you know better than I, which is quite possible, do it your way. But let me show you how I do it. Oh, by the way, at the end of the video, I'll show you how to do this on a Mac. So let's head out to the computer. Here we are on the computer. And if you happen to have on your keyboard a Windows button and a print screen button, they love each other. If you hold them down at the exact same time, what it does is it takes a picture of your entire computer screen and then you can paste it anywhere. Say for example, inside a Microsoft product or into a product you have on your computer such as Paint or Notepad. Now finding the actual file can be really tricky for some people. So most people often paste it somewhere and then they resave it and do things like that. Now, if that doesn't work for you, you can use another cool tool. In fact, this is the tool that I use most of the time. It's called the snipping tool. And there's a good chance you have this on your PC. How do you find it? Well, usually in the lower left-hand portion of your screen, you should have some sort of search area. If you start typing in snipping tool, or nowadays you can usually speak it if you have the newer versions. But I see snipping tool here. I click on it and I get a menu of options. No time to talk about all of these. The most basic way to use this is click on new. And then you get these crosshairs, select the area that you'd like to take a picture of. Boom. And now you have this menu of options. The easiest way to deal with this image now is to save it somewhere, such as in your pictures folder or wherever else you save things and then you can send it or do whatever else you do with pictures. Now, before we leave this, I wanna show you a couple cool features on the snipping tool. There's a pen button. If you click it, let's say you click blue pen, for example, you can draw all over your image and then you can save it. There's a highlighter and an eraser. That's how some people are able to draw on images. Now, if you don't have a PC, you have a Mac and you're like, hey, this isn't fair. I wanna learn how to do it on a Mac. Well, it's pretty easy. So let's head over a Mac and I'll show you what to do there. If you're on a Mac computer, if you simply hold down the command button, the shift and four, you should get a set of crosshairs and you can take a picture of whatever you want and then it'll be saved on the computer, on the area, in the finder area in, on your Mac. Also, you can hold down the command button, shift and three, it'll take a picture of the entire screen and then that'll also be saved in your finder area on a Mac. Well, I hope this little video helps. Best of luck, everybody.